following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 242 pounds, Victor the Cyborg Stone. All these superstars come into this match incredibly hungry to prove their dominance. I can't wait to see what unfolds. He is in perhaps the best shape of his career, and he will need that with the competition level this high. And his opponent, from New York, weighing in at 225 pounds, Nicholas J. Furious. Hey, where's the horse? What are you talking about? Yeah, what horse? The high horse this superstar always seems to be on. Did Jerry Lawler write that line for you? He said he'll steal the show here tonight, and he looks more than ready to deliver on that promise. potential for curveballs and surprises here in this no disqualification match you take out that stipulation and you open the door to a lot of shenanigans michael weapons outside interference you never know what's going to happen in a match like this oh right to the spine both wrists captured and wow. firm control oh man kick to the face Just defenseless as the momentum is against him. He's got to wake up and get in the fight. This match grinded him down a little. Got him up. Boom! Oh, down across God. the knee. Both arms captured and vitriolic stops. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. Byron, how does this matchup require a different mindset? A superstar must be prepared to go all out, be as aggressive and vicious as possible. Remember, it's no disqualification. The superstars can do whatever they want, but it can only end with a three count or a tap up. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. From the top! Kick connects from the top. Uh-oh. Fighting back with a counter. Oh, kick right to the back. Oh, God. He's positioning himself, closing in. Oh, look at this. Is it enough, guys? Is Shot it enough to get back in this match? Wow. So far, so good. Now he's been put on the defensive. He leaves the ring, and there's no countouts in this one. A stop sign. Was there some road work going on that I didn't know about? He gets back into the ring. 
He's turning the tables. Shot right to the gut. Ouch! Jumping knee strike. I like that. He's getting fired up now, really feeding off this crowd. Just one step ahead. And returning to the ring. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Look at all these boots to the face. Here comes a big one. Ooh. competitor. You have to believe this one's going to be decided by the smallest of margins. Followed by a forearm smash. Oh, what a spear! This could be the chance he was looking for. He's got to know he's in harm's way here. Look at this. Oh, straight to the floor. Tempted fate and paid dearly for it. That haphazard approach definitely proved costly. No. Oh. Ripcord applied. Boom. Knock him down. Ouch. You can't take much more of this. There is no way this can go on for much longer. Precision strike to the back of the neck. And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. Oh my gosh, terminating knee smash. Uh-oh. Harlem sidekick. He is revving up the engine. He's not going to let anything stop him. Great counter. Great wherewithal on the counter. Oh, man, meeting the barricade. The adrenaline is pumping, and the WWE Universe is on his side. Beautiful arm ringer applied. Followed by a Larry right to the face. Here's a combo of strikes. Rights and lefts, elbows, knees, all of them lethal. Now did it. palm strikes. He's back into the ring. feeling pretty good about yourself. These superstars took each other to the absolute limit. Well past the limit, I'd say.